Well, moving on, Srinagar, which is considered to be one of the most beautiful cities in Jammu and Kashmir and most of India, in fact, is now in a state of filth as heaps of garbage remain uncollected for the last two days. The sanitation workers are on an indefinite strike against a civic body demanding the release of pending salary. In fact, my colleague Farid uh, joins us right now on the show. Uh, Farid, if, if you could just tell me what this strike is about, because this is not the first time it's happened in Srinagar. This is the second time in a couple of months that the sanitation workers have gone on strike. What is their demand this time? And does this have to do with the complete lack of, uh, you know, of coherence in the government, in the local body government of Srinagar? Uh, well, yes, Faye, you're absolutely right. This is not the first time that uh, uh, there has been a municipal crisis. Uh, previously, also, we have uh, done stories where for days uh, there was crisis in the Senegal Municipal Corporation. Mayor and Deputy Mayor kept fighting, and that led to a complete uh, functional paralysis as far as uh, the municipality is concerned. That uh, was somehow sorted out, though our sources say that uh, in deep inside there's still a lot of bickering and uh, uh, in fact that is also taking its toll on the functioning of the municipality. Now the latest is uh, that uh, the Safai Karamcharis uh, have been on strike since yesterday. What they're demanding is uh, release of uh, their salaries. For the past six months they have not been paid. Now this is uh, very basic when you talk of uh, municipality. Uh, where they need uh, the, the first line as far as the uh, public service are the Safai Karmcharis and they need to be paid. They say from the last six months they have not been paid. To add to that, they say that they are not being given basics as far as uh, job requirements are concerned, tools, uh, boots, uh, uh, uniforms uh, that are not being given. And let me tell you, uh, this is happening when we know that municipality is earning uh, uh, big time. A lot of, uh, uh, in fact, everyone pays uh, the municipality in one way or the other. So there is no shortage of money, but no, no money for these people. And They've, this is related to this strike. So uh, it is not only about municipality. Fair. In fact, uh, every sphere of public life uh, is suffering right now. People are suffering big time, be it uh, uh, the municipal crisis or be it the uh, garbage that is littered across the Srinagar city or uh, the Jammu Srinagar National Highway that has been shut literally from the last two months. Essential services have been affected. You talk of uh, airfares. So as we, had, we have been reporting through the day, have uh, literally skyrocketed. No, but, but Farid, uh, uh, give us some perspective. Taking full toll uh, on uh, the common man. Yeah. Give us some perspective. Obviously, it, it's one thing to have uh, sanitation workers go on strike in any city. But in a city that's currently facing a cold wave where you've had an unusually, uh, you know, a, a large amount of snowfall, uh, what is, and you did say that they don't have gloves, they don't have boots, they don't have the right uniform, they haven't been paid for six months. What is the excuse of the government? Have you spoken to the government? How are these workers expected to function in the snow, in the biting cold, without boots and without gloves and without uniforms? Absolutely, Faye. In fact, uh, we did ask this question to uh, the people that matter, the administration. They say that they had sorted out the issue with uh, these very workers. But uh, the fact of the matter is that this is typical uh, admin mentality where they uh, promise the skies but fail to deliver on very basics. Now, these workers say that uh, they had uh, been promised time and again from the last many, many years. But when it comes to implementing those promises, the government has time and again uh, backtracked. So there is absolute uh, distrust. Uh, there is no trust between the, uh, the, the, the administration and uh, these workers, they say that uh, they, they do their job in extreme conditions, as, as you're absolutely right, in biting cold, very tough conditions to work. They do their job every day, keep Srinagar clean, and in return, they're not even paid basic salaries, monthly salaries. On the other hand, you have these councillors who are enjoying the perks uh, uh, of power, and uh, you have uh, the newly elected mayor and deputy mayor who, uh, in fact, uh, other than fighting with each other, mm. uh, have really failed to deliver on the ground. So these, these, these issues have uh, literally snowballed as, as far as the Srinagar municipality is concerned and ultimately yes. it is the common man uh, who is suffering. People are suffering and uh, luckily it's snowing right now so that is acting as a kind of a sanitizer. Imagine if it would have been summers, this would have been a huge, huge issue for the common man. Faye? Absolutely. Farid, uh, we also, Farid has also spoken with uh, people on the ground and this is how the citizens of Srinagar have responded.
people have been suffering a lot uh, due to the uh, Srinagar Municipal Corporation. The functioning of the corporation is always in the uh, news for bad reasons. Recently, we had seen uh, how the, uh, the internal bickering between mayor and deputy mayor uh, caused a lot of problems, not only the employees, but to, to the citizens of this uh, Srinagar city. Now, the employees on our strike, they uh, just want that their salary should be released. But uh, the mayor and the commissioner had actually assured them that their salaries uh, will be released, but till date nothing has happened on the ground, and we can, you can yourself see uh, how a uh, heap of garbage are lying on the roads. As a common man, I feel that this government should address all their issues at an earliest because it is the people of the uh, of the Srinagar city who have been suffering because of the strike. There have been so many issues, made be of sanitation, huge garbage dumps. You can see how the garbage is lying just in this dustbin. So these things need to be taken care of. Our demand is simple and genuine. Hai. Wo ye ke हमारी फर्स्ट डिमांड है जो हमारे सफाई कर्मचारी है जैसे ये आप देख लीजिए हमारे सफाई कर्मचारी है इनका इनका जो पे है इनका जो पे है ये हमें इंटरनल रिसोर्सेस है इनको मिलना चाहिए ये हमारा सफाई कर्मचारी जब सुबह निकलता है पूरी शहर की सफाई करता है क्या ये मुमकिन है क्या ये अफसोस की बात नहीं है कि इस सफाई कर्मचारी को फिर एक महीने के बाद अगर सैलरी नहीं देंगे या सैलरी के लिए तड़पाएंगे ये एक बहुत बहुत इनजस्टिस है and of course, uh, Farid, many thanks for bringing us this story. On Mirror Now, our attempt is to look at the state of Jammu and Kashmir, particularly the Valley of Kashmir, and consider it like any other part of this country, cover it like any other city, and demand amenities for its taxpaying citizens like we do for any other part of India. So if the garbage is not being picked up, in the biting snow, if they don't have enough electricity, if the roads are a mess and if the money is being siphoned away, we're going to find space on prime time to demand for the rights of those citizens. Uh, Farid Bray, many thanks for bringing us that story. Moving on now.